So today we're uplifting a problem that has chronically affected Latinas in the workforce, and that is that we have unequal pay for providing the same amount of labor and work in our economy. Latinas earn on average 52 cents to the dollar compared to white male counterparts in the workforce. And that is something that has contributed to a huge disparity of economic stability in our communities throughout the nation. And so here in Los Angeles, I continue to uplift this information to make sure that we start to take the corrective and intentional actions to help level that playing field. Today was an amazing day. I was privileged and honored to receive a recognition from the city of Los Angeles from Councilman Rodriguez in honor of the work that I and many have done over many years for Latin Equal Pay. We hope that we're able to make the changes necessary. So being able to receive a recognition on top of being able to do that important work, I mean, it's, it's just truly an honor. And I just want all the Latinas to know that this is a movement that we have created together by the millions of Latinas across the country. It's kind of amazing. Uh, we, uh, you know, I started 21 years ago working with uh, this agency, Women in Non-Traditional Employment Roles, and back then nobody talked about equity and construction and building trades. It was more about this is men's career, and nobody included women. So it's amazing that now other people are talking about it versus only being me talking about it. I think it's incredibly important to have the city council recognize the issue because, you know, first of all, this is one of the biggest cities in the entire United States. And so I think it sends a message to other cities that they need to be paying attention to this too. And not just talking about it, but really doing something about it. Um, this pay gap is one that's existed for decades, and it's one that's having a grave impact, not just on Latinas today, but into the future. It's critically important that we all show up in this space to make sure that we have gender equity, that we have pay equity. Whether you're in a leadership role or whether you are that worker, we must continue to organize, mobilize, and work with intentionality to change this environment for everyone.